Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to be going over top five POS systems. I've controlled a lot of businesses throughout all realms, whether it's restaurants, I've worked with like brick and mortar systems. I've worked with so many different companies and finding a true POS system in that's going to meet all of my qualifications that I need as far as pricing goes, as far as interchangeability, the interface, all of these things were very important with me. Well, I've conducted a review right now that you're watching for the top five best. Now we're going to be going over those. And if you want to click in the link in the description, you can find free trials of those and some discounts to try them for yourself. Now, the big thing here was for me to find these POS systems that were going to save me time and save me money and also make my job a lot easier. Let's dive in and check out the first one. So starting for number one, I have square. Now, some of the pros that I found with Square was that the baseline POS is actually free and there isn't a monthly subscription fee. There's no long term contracts and you can cancel any time. So even when I as I'm making this review, I was able to decide that this was number one, because if I don't want a contract and I want to change or I find one that's a little bit better, that was a big plus for me. They have tools for retail, professional services, and restaurants, so pretty much all across the board. And it has a free integrated e-commerce site as well. Some of the setbacks of this, though, was that it's locked into the square for payment processing, which I wasn't a big fan of. And I didn't have much phone support. It was very limited. So when I ran into a problem, I couldn't just call and actually get them to help me so much so easily. And also, the vendor management does require third party integrations, which is also a setback for me. So it supports businesses from independent craft service businesses, the brick and mortar retail, e-commerce, food and beverage businesses, restaurants, appointment based businesses and salons and etc. But it doesn't support high risk businesses. So with the free version of this, it is free. There is no monthly software fee. But there is a premium, which is $60, and they have an enterprise, but it's custom quoted only. There isn't an installation fee. Of course, it's do-it-yourself, and the contract length is month-to-month. -month. There is an in-person processing fee of 2.6% plus $0.10, cents, and an online processing fee of 2.9% with $0.30. Cents. So for number two, I have Lightspeed. It's got a detailed inventory with analytics, and it's got a robust integrated e-commerce platform. And another big plus for me, which puts it number two, is 24 seven customer support and onboarding. And they have a 14 day free trial as well. Now the setbacks or drawbacks, if you will, is that the interface can actually take some time to learn and it can get rather pricey for small businesses. And the shipping integrations are limited. So if you're trying to ship a product, you're going to have a little bit of issues with that. It does support brick and mortar retailers, multi-channel retailers, food and beverage, uh, full service and quick service restaurants, and even golf courses. It also doesn't support high risk businesses though. And the monthly software fee is $69 to $289. That varies by the POS type, the payment processor and the payment plan. There isn't an installation fee. Of course, it's the same and you have a contract length of one year. The in-person processing fee though is 2.6% for and 10 cents and the other processors may vary as well the online processing fees however is 2.6 plus 30 cents and the other processes vary just as well now number three is sliding in is toast it's got a free starter pos you can pay as you go plan and it lets small restaurants buy two ps terminals for no upfront cost which is really really big it's got a robust inventory with purchase order management and it has flexible online ordering and delivery tools as well. The drawback to this though is locked into toast for payment processing and there are a two year contract and it operates on a proprietary hardware. Of course, the business types here are restaurants such as like quick service and full service food and beverage businesses, bars, your coffee shops, so forth and so on. It does not support though retail businesses, service businesses, or high risk businesses, simply being that it's mostly a restaurant type deal. Now the monthly service fee, uh, the pay as you go is free. The starter or the standard is $69 essentials at $165 and you can get a custom with a custom quote. Of course the installation fee, which is optional, it starts at around 250 bucks. The contract length again is two years 
and you have that in-person processing fee as pay-as-you-go plan is for 2.99 percent and 15 cents additionally now there's also a standard which is the 2.49 percent at 15 cents plus but the online processing fees i could not find information so it was not disclosed All right so now we have number four vend what I liked about this was that it has a 14 day free trial. You can choose from built in or third party payment processing. It's got a flexible checkout features and built in loyalty store credit and layaway options. Now it does have age verification tools and flexible processing support and it supports some higher risk businesses. The drawbacks to this though, is that the e-commerce functions do require integration and reporting is rather basic and it doesn't into it does not have integrated email marketing as well so it does support businesses like your brick and mortar retailers the multi-channel retailers will buy third-party integrations and some high-risk businesses but if you're in the food and beverage businesses it does not support and the monthly software fee it varies by the processor type and whether you pay annually or monthly the contract length is for one year and the in-person processing fees also vary by the processor as well as the online processing fees as well. Okay, so for the last one, I have Shopify. Definitely, it's definitely not the least of the choice, but it is the last one. The cool things that Shopify has to offer is that it has a 14 day free trial. There's a smart omni-channel and inventory tools free at your disposal. It's easy to use, it's rather intuitive and it has a great, great interface. And so it's probably the best in class for e-commerce platform. But some of the things that I didn't like is that the offline mode can be rather glitchy. It has a free POS, and, and but it has those limited features. So if you're really needing more of that, you should actually upgrade. The POS subscription requires e-commerce subscription, and that price can actually add up. It supports your businesses like your e-commerce business, that multi-channel retail, restaurants, uh, e-commerce platform only though, so no restaurant POS tools. But it, and it doesn't support high-risk businesses, brick and mortar restaurants. Now, as far as the fees go, there's the basic fee of $29, you have Shopify for $79, and the advanced at $300. So the monthly POS software fee the light is included with the e-commerce subscription, and then there's the pro, which is $89 per location. The installation fee is zero because it's do-it-yourself, which is a big plus. And the contract length, the options are for month-to-month, -month, annual, or multi-year. The in-person processing fees for the basic is 2.7%, and Shopify at 2.5%. They also have the advanced at 2.4%. If we're speaking about the processing fees for online, it's 2.9 plus the 30 cents. Now I've went through five of the best POS systems that you can have on the market right now. So jump into the description, sign up for your free trials, and take advantage of those discounts provided to you below. Thank you guys for watching.